Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. Today, this video will show how to replace uh, cleaning unit for a DTF printer or a normal Epson L1800 printers. Okay, so even we know here is already a used this cleaning unit even when working with the special DTF ink that we get not well maintenance they easily get the problem with the print head and that's the problem the ink the ink dry with this the wiper and also flowing into this the parts and also this the, this cup and the ink dry inside. When you do a heat cleaning, so here must get a problem. Or even we just turn on the printer, this part can be not reset well, then we will be get the lighting with the printer, even we'll turn on the machine, and the per turn on the printer, we will be get the lighting so that's the most problem from the cleaning pump. Okay. So this the video we will show how to replace this unit or get the clean or repairments inside the printers. Okay. See the normal machine working with the full color. So that's the tree for with the feature in front side. And this type of a roller machine. Here lock this cover both of eight screw for lock down is the power. The firstly we move this ink tank under this and uh, just take off each screw from the place one, two, three, four, five, six and then open this cover here okay both side seven the last one for the video even we move the all the eight piece of its go that we can move the cover up okay. See, normally even you install this tree, we also need to move this tree first. Here two of of school lock down. And this is roller and the the shade machine, they are same same. Okay. Two hours ago, let's move. And in, in the bottom, also have four pieces of screw that we already take off. So we can. Here, this connector, we try to take it off. Okay. Then, we try to move this jet. Then, this is the roller or the sheet or the paper hanger we can move. And this, this printer is come with a, a roller control bar. So, if you are working with the type of it carefully, that we can see, okay. Sometimes, if you are with the roller machine, that we also have a, a detect cable inside that we need to move from the, the board also. Okay. Now we can turn the machine to see clear that. We are ready to do 
Okay, we can move the ink system also. The normally this this cards be locked with the machine. That we can to use a, this type of driver. Just turn in place three rollers. This locker be be open. That we can move in one, two, three. Then we can easily to move this card to the left side of printer. Okay. So the next step we are ready to replace this cleaning inlet that we need to take it out the first. Okay. Okay. Now we are ready to take this cleaning inlet out of the machine. That way before we need to move this signatory pump first two of three piece of school lock okay that's a way can move this pump right now okay and the set the flowing here normally have a seven piece of screw to lock down this a clean unit that's the first one we need to move this piece okay and the second one Going one and in the back side here and then this for wire cable we also of them okay and uh, in the top of side this place also have one piece of school okay that's the way we take all the school out then we can try to move this cleaning unit out okay so Normally, this will be connected with our the waste ink bottle. Okay, the the some of our thing we connect the, this tube, this clip, and then we can fast to move them, and then we can take this bottle and easy to do a clean okay now we try to move this part this part out and here just forget one of school just remember which school you take from that's even you in start back because we're totally we took the screw from this first one the second one the third one fourth here and the last one here and the top one here This place, so totally one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
seven piece of school lock down. Okay. Then we can move this this part out. We also have a detached cable that we need to move them out. This fast the different version, and this one is connected with the main bar on the other side. So sometimes we also need to move this part, this plastic part out. And uh, even this is the new version that be easy, just the move here from the connector that we can easy to move. To move. Then we should take this part plastic a little more. Okay. Then here just throw this okay. And the uh, one bit. So here mostly the four pieces of the holder inside and uh, should the uh, white one would choose by hand to move a little out so we can take them out. As we can see this cable connect with this here with the main bar, we just move them and then to be clear and uh, make sure that we take them out okay. the next step we try to move this plus parts out that we need to move this part out also now we try to move this billet out see a little hard then then we need to get a little more up of printer See here, screw one, and uh, we can move them up a little more up to be easy to push this unit out. See, just take this three piece of screw in the right side to make. Okay, so for the left side, also have two of piece of screw to knock. Okay, just turn a little off. Okay, the last one. That we can move this printer body a little up by our hands okay then we can move up the printer body by right hand and uh, take the clean unit out of the printer by the left hand okay Okay, so following we will try to replace this the new cleaning unit. So you can see here's the cup. We try slowly to move them. Okay. And uh, usually we can see this cable this cup to be placed. Sometimes be changed in the station as we need to check and make sure. Okay. And uh, now we try to Install back this part. Okay. 
and uh, this one the the with the ink tube already connect is throw down in the bottom of of the parts okay then try to No need to set a cleaning unit in the place. Then check all of the tube. That should be well throw down. Okay, and also this cable. That's what we need to check. And yeah, that will be ready to connect and. Uh, here, this soft tube, that would be wear throw. Then we can knock down the piece of screw back of the place. Okay. And we can see. Remember, here's seven piece of screw. Okay. Right now, we. This is the first piece. From the top piece. Here this this part it should be installed back. The difference the this top side is a little more big and uh, this side okay. Now the seat back Then we can see here make sure this is already in place okay. and then we try ready to install back this part. Where this one should be in place and uh, this place, okay. Then we can not buy school. Another piece. Okay, so last two, two piece should be the back side. Here. This two piece, okay. Last one should be okay. 
these two pieces of wire connect through these two okay. together in the knockdown. Okay. To be check our wheel and then we're ready to lock this printer. Okay. And also the Lock to the left side. Okay. And uh, we now we need to set this cable to connect the print and uh, try to install back this connector for the main board that way we need to see only the black connector inside okay the black one that way this two side be back side and just try to connect And uh, once we install, we have to check if we make any or this cable out. We should be check again. Okay. Here, one piece of cable out. We're ready to connect them back. Okay. That's our wire. Then. This one we connect the waste link bottle. Then we connect back this waste ink bottle. Okay, sit back. And uh, now set them back. Okay. Okay. Now from the left to right. Just push push this part back. Before we connect the cover back, that we need to make sure that the cleaning unit is well installed. Okay, we're ready to power on the machine to check if the printer can be ready or not. Okay. The first time will be take a few seconds. If the printer did not get any lighting, that should be ready. Okay, so keep this green light. Now the printer ready. We can we can get the print and get the cleaning. Okay, so thanks for your watching.